you're saying they should do a partner deal. Well, definitely. Like, yes. <laughs> this is Sad Men Products. Sad Men Products. <laughs> oh, no. Hey. Listen. Sad men need things, too, okay? <laughs> Today we will be cooking corn dogs. First you take a sloppy wiener and bat it in a nice breaded coating and cook it in deep fried oil. Anyway. All right, now you can start. Now we can start. Hey everybody, welcome back to Journey to the Center of the Corn Dog. My name is Amy. And as always, I am joined today with the birthday boy, my husband, my co-host, Andrew. Hey, what's going on, wieners? How's it going, Amy? Good. It's your pretty much your birthday. Pretty much tomorrow. At the time of recording this, tomorrow is my birthday. Yes. So, uh, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you. Yes. Happy birthday. One wiener older. That's right. One <laughs> wiener older. But you know what? You're a young buck. Hey, you're I'm, okay. Yeah, I'm hanging in there. Yeah. I'm doing all right. You're doing okay. I'm, I'm making do with what I got. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You're doing great. Yeah, it's great. I think it is hard. Like, for us, we're getting into, like, our early to mid-30s, and... Uh, hold what? On, hold on there, brother. Hold, what? <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on there. I'm I'm moving past mid-30s into my late my late 30s oh there, brother. Oh, my gosh. Late 30s sounds so much later. You're going to be 36. Hold on there, brother. That's that's past the midpoint. That, uh, <laughs> I know, but you know what? You can't say early 30s when I'm turning 36. Yeah, I'm in my early yeah, 30s. You can yeah. talk for yourself. <laughs> Speak for yourself, okay? I got to live on that high note right now, okay? Yeah, yeah. So, All right. I, I see you down there mocking me. No, but listen, you always say you're so old, but you are so young. No, I'm not old. I'm I'm definitely not old. Some yeah. days I feel old because I have like my own aches and pains, but that's just that's just the way of human existence. Exactly. So, Everybody does. Yeah, you know, sometimes your wiener gets a little broken. Ew. Metaphorically. <laughs> Uh, Metaphor. No, cut that out. No, <laughs> that definitely shit. keep that I in. I meant like you know, like visualizing a corn dog. Metaphorically, now. I meant like visualizing a corn dog. You know, the cornbread's yeah. starting to crack a little bit. Yeah. You know, you're you're not. Metaphorically now, but for real later in life. Maybe it, later it I'll might, have a broken wiener, but not break. right now. I'm good. Everything's good. It, it could break. Eventually, hey, everything breaks eventually, right? That's right. So. I'm wow, not uh, we're super this is, uplifting. This has been off the rails. Anyway, Amy, you. Before I get to my topic, which I know you're gonna love. Oh gosh. Oh, it's right up your alley. Uh, Can't wait. Um, I'm scared. No, don't be scared. Don't be scared, homie. What's your <laughs> <laughs> What's your? Uh, you said you had a news story for yeah, me. Yeah, I just I I just saw this really just funny article. So it's in Turkey. Okay. And the land of my people. Yes, right? Maybe. 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 Who knows? We somewhere, never did a... Somewhere in that region. Somewhere. Um, there was a man who was out drinking all night. Okay. And his wife was concerned because he didn't come home. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So she called the police and they conducted a giant search party to go find him. Because good, somebody good. said the last time they saw him was out in the woods. You know, that's, well, what? you know. You're drunk. That might be where you end up. I don't know. They, somebody spotted him in the woods? Yeah, like last seen in the woods. So he was in the woods. Okay. And he fell asleep. And when he woke up, the search party was going on. And he joined the search party to help no. find <laughs> himself. What is wrong <laughs> with people? No. Yeah, and it actually went on for like a couple hours until he realized he heard like his name kept being called and then he was like that's me and no one believed him because they were like what no you're helping us and he's like no that's me that was me oh and then his friends came and found him and confirmed it was him that's hilarious. I know. That's amazing. Can you imagine just waking up from a drunken stupor <laughs> and being like, but like, honestly, how great of a man is he that he just woke up, probably didn't That's, feel great. Yeah. And was like, oh, 
I, I got to like jump into <laughs> oh, action shoot, here. Somebody's lost. Someone's yeah. lost we, in the woods. I can't believe somebody's lost. We got to find them. Gary. <laughs> Gary. <laughs> Gary, oh, where are you? Oh, hold on. Oh, okay. Oh, let me. Oh, I'm a little, little hungover, but all right. Whew, still kind of drunk. All right. Gary, where are you at, Gary? <laughs> we'll find you. Don't worry. It's so funny because in the article, it says he slept it off and then woke up. <laughs> To join the <laughs> search party, I was like, he did not sleep that off. No, not you if you can't w- be that. Not if you wake up and are searching for yourself. You did not sleep it off, <laughs> not fully. <laughs> no, he was very much still wasted. That's amazing. That's one of the best search and rescue stories I've ever I know, heard. In my but life. what a sweet man to just join in on on the search and rescue. You oh know. My gosh. But true story. That's amazing. I, I know. Wow. That's probably one of the best things I've heard in a while. I mean, Love do it. you think he felt bad or no? I Probably. He probably then realized like, oh, crap, all these people are out looking for me. Yeah. And I'm looking for myself. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and he literally found himself. How many? How long did he search with it the search party? It said a couple hours. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Gary! <laughs> Gary, where are Where's you? Where's this Gary guy? <laughs> Jeez. Hmm, wait a minute. That's my name. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think, like, the rescuers, you know, they gather together. People are, like, getting food, getting water, just, you know, to help yeah. everybody. And he's, like, snacking and, like, eating. And it's <laughs> like, like, oh, oh this man, is great Gotta get to my energy up. up. <laughs> we, could, we could be out here all night looking for this guy. <laughs> <laughs> I need some crackers. I gotta find Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, oh. getting a little parched Woo. Ooh, gotta, know, right? gotta rehydrate so i can find gary oh my goodness <laughs> his poor wife what, what do you think his wife said when she found out she's probably like you're never going out again <laughs> probably like you idiot you're such an idiot <laughs> i mean i think yeah i would definitely feel stupid but you know what though you have to feel kind of loved i'm wondering though you'd be like wow all these people came out to find me yeah that's great but then yeah I'm, on the flip side, I'm kind of questioning the integrity of the search party that they didn't notice a passed out man just get up off the ground and join the party. Well, he, I mean, how they must you're not, not going to turn down help. Yeah, but they must have been spaced out pretty poorly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. To like not see him like sleeping and then get up and be like, I don't Whoa. know. If it's the middle of the night, maybe he just got up and walked over and was like, hey. What, what, what's going on here? <laughs> and they're like, oh, well, we're looking for uh, a man named Gary. We're looking for Gary Johnson. And he... we can't find him. <laughs> and he's like, oh, well, let Wait me, let me Gary, help you. Gary Should Johnson, I... the guy who ran for president. <laughs> 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 I didn't even try that. <laughs> the libertarian candidate yes. from a few years ago. It might have just been him. It was probably Gary Johnson. <laughs> Gary Johnson. You know, gosh, I love that man. He liked to partake of, you know, the uh, the Mary Jane. Yeah, he was yeah. more into that world. Mm-hmm. But um, amazing man. <laughs> I just, I, I don't care what anyone says. I really wish he would have been president. Hey, he got my vote. That's yeah. all I'm going to say. He got my vote. <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank you, Amy. I needed that. That little juicy nugget yeah. of a story in my you life. like that? Mm, I did. It was it's uplifting. Good. Um, Makes you feel good about yourself. Yeah. Right? Well, after a night of drinking, you know, it could happen to the best of us. Yeah, that's true. Amy? Yes. Um, I, uh, I was scrolling the old gram today, the old Instagram. Yeah. And I got recommended. I got an advertisement. Oh, okay. For a product that I've never seen in my life. Well, I, the it's a it's a spin on a product that we all use, but this this spin on this product was very interesting, and I immediately was like, "Wow, this is crazy!" How do I want to present this to you? I don't want to just give it away. Is it a flashlight? No, <laughs> no. Oh, I don't no, know. No, I don't know where you're going no. with this. No, get out of here. I'm sorry. Get out of here, know. you dirty just, mind. I know. I'm right, sorry. You, you go look for Gary or something <laughs> <laughs> with that dirty mind. No. All right. Let me think how I can best present this to you. Okay. Sometimes, you know, you go to bed, your pillow's a little uncomfortable, right? You're like trying to fluff it up, trying to make it more comfortable, but it's just always flat, right? Nobody enjoys like their pillow being super flat, or maybe you just can't get comfortable. You've seen the pillow cube. You've seen my pillow, all these Serta pillows, 
you know, they claim to be the best. No, Amy, I have found you the best pillow. What if I told you? Because what's the softest thing you can imagine that that would just be a dream to sleep on? Like, imagine you could take anything in this world and turn it into a pillow, and that's what you would want to sleep on all the time. What's the softest thing you can think of? I don't know, because the only thing that comes to my mind is a pillow. Like, (laughs) a marshmallow? No, 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 no. Close now, but no. Oh, softer. it's a wrong answer. Wrong. Softer. Oh, okay. We're talking the softest thing. The softest thing. Just, I mean, a feather down is pretty soft. Mm, no, 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 no. You're 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 going about this all wrong. Okay. Imagine, if you will, Amy, that you could take, for example, Nicki Minaj's butt, and sleep on that. That could be your pillow. Something so. Or a Kim Kardashian's luscious rump, and you could just sleep on that all night. You know, it's just giant and round and probably pretty soft. Well, Amy, I have the product for you, the buttress. It is a pillow shaped like a giant woman's booty. Yes, Amy, I know it's hard to believe, but this exists, and it was brought to my eyes via the weird algorithm of ads on Instagram. It is literally, yes, a pillow shaped like a giant booty. And it comes in three sizes. Oh, no. (laughs) (laughs) Are you intrigued? Would you like to know more? Well, yes, but I'm not surprised. So the ad that I got, it's the buttress pillow, and it says thick thighs save lives. And it is a woman clutching a booty, well, a pillow that's shaped like a booty. Okay. Okay. Um, now, they come in different sizes. There's the original ODB buttress pillow. There's the OMG buttress pillow, which is larger. And then if you really want that maximum comfort, you're going to want to get the ORT buttress pillow, which is... What does ORT stand for? I have for? no idea. I thought, see, they, they really missed out. They could have called I it like know. the Becky or something. Yes, I... That's what I was thinking. Yeah, like they yeah. screwed up. They, they really did. The, the Kim. Yeah. They could have the, called the it like, yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 They really blew it. They blew it. Now, and they blew it with the name. What's it called? The, butt Mistress or something? <laughs> the Butt Tris but, Pillow. Butt Orama is what but, they should I think have. it's like Butt Mattress. Terrible name. Amy, I know. I wish I was part of the okay, marketing wait, team. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we should be the marketing team for this okay, product. Okay, that's right. That's okay. correct. Give me your number one fix for this this brilliant idea. My, what do you mean? How would you? You're you're hired on. They're like, Amy, we need you to start changing this product, like advertising it for the better. We need to sell butts. We need to sell <laughs> butts to butts. All right. First of all, he- we need to get heads on our butts. First of all, <laughs> that's correct. We do need to get heads on the butts. <laughs> But first of all, the picture that you showed me is a woman sleeping on the butt pillow, right? Yes. Uh, Listen, whatever you're into, it's fine. But I I just think the the target market here is going to be men. Sad men. Sad men. Lonely men. (laughs) So, but that's, but that's the genius. Lonely men don't want to see other men enjoying the pillow oh. I think I think they were right in that fact Amy oh my gosh they should be they should be using women in the advertising okay yeah you got you're me not, there you're not thinking like a man here I'm not you're no. right I'm not okay so but the picture itself is not great no it's it doesn't really show the product very well it just looks like a, a weirdly shaped pillow okay but let me take you to their uh website like so that's that's the the big one that's the big mama <laughs> Now, the creepy part is, is that they also sell yoga pant pillow covers as well as thong underwear to put on the, yeah, the pillow yeah, butt. okay. Makes it way more creepy. But yes. I, A I, thousand percent. But I'm guessing that's what their audience wants. I don't know. Like, I feel like they're completely, like, all over the place. They Someone had, like, a kind of good idea. Where yeah. they, if you market this as like a snuggie, like it has to be a joke product. Yeah. I feel like they're taking themselves too seriously. Well, I mean, there's got to be a market for it. <sighs> you know, some people are just really like, that's what they want to snuggle up to. You My know? thing is, is it even comfortable? 
probably not. It's probably it's not meant. It's not <laughs> meant to sleep on all night. It might be meant to give you comfort. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you're gonna be buying that that uh what's it called flashlight at the same time. Oh as gosh. That. I'm just saying. I'm not they, trying to be gross, but this. You're is, saying they should do a partner deal. Well, definitely. Like, yes. <laughs> this is Sad Men products. Sad Men products. <laughs> Oh no! Hey, listen. Sad men need things too. Okay, they definitely do. Sad men. Listen, are if out you want to buy a butt pillow that has fake yoga pants and thongs on it, <laughs> I mean, it's not hurting anybody. No, it's more power to you. I honestly though, like if you kind of just, it does genuinely look like a butt. Well, it should. Yeah, but I'm just saying they got that part of the product right. Right. Like the name is terrible. Right. The advertising's not so great. But the product, like, they, it's like they put all of their money into the product, but then they don't know how to advertise it to the right people. What's the, what are the names of the different size pills? We got small, medium, and large. So we start out with the ODB. What does ODB mean? It's probably some slang, but I don't know. The, like you said, you had the best idea, naming it Becky or... Or Kim, Kim or Nikki. Nikki. That would be great. Um, oh. I can't think of any other famous big. What would be people. the biggest one though? Becky, maybe. That's that's got to be right. That's the best because that harkens back to you know Sir Mix a lot. Yes, and that's that's the OG. Yeah. So yeah, the biggest one should be Becky. What's then? What's below that? I think that? the smallest should maybe be Kim and then Nikki. You think? Ah, uh, switch it up. Nikki, Kim, Kim Becky. Becky. Perfect. Yeah. You're you would sell so many more. Yeah, definitely. <sighs> I'm not gonna lie. When I see the picture of this lady, this lovely lady, <laughs> snuggled up in this big booty, uh huh, it looks comfortable. Yeah, it does. You can't it deny. It really does. But then it's weird because then when you look at it, like initially the my first thought when I saw it was, oh, that looks comfortable. But then you do see the shape of the butt. So like right. I could do without the shape of the butt. I think obviously, it's, it's just a big cushy pillow, no matter what. So like it's gonna right. be. There's gonna be some level of comfort. Let yeah. me see if I can find... Just got a crack and a thong in it, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it had yoga pants on, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's... Uh, yeah. For those listening, if you haven't looked it up, it's like, it's not just a butt. It's a butt and, like, legs. Like, yeah. thighs. Yeah. We neglected to mention that. So it's not just, like, just a butt. That's the weird part, is that it's like... Uh, imagine like, like the middle of a mannequin like a like bicycle shorts if you yeah. fill the bicycle shorts with a padding. pillow yeah with yeah. padding i think they're maybe they are going just for like fetish kind of i guess so which it's gonna be like a smaller group rather than it's yeah a large that's group what like I'm the snuggie. saying they went too narrow but if you made it like a funny th like if you lean into it really hard I feel like you could sell more. Oh, yeah, definitely. And that's the way to go. But it's a little bit too sexual to make it like a... Yeah, that's the problem. Yeah. It's too sexual. If it was a little more comical... Yeah. Then it would be acceptable. Because, like, nobody's going to buy that and have it in their house because it's embarrassing. Right. Like, it would be... It's too realistic to just have... Oh, it's as realistic. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. It's too realistic to have just around your house. If it was in a flesh-colored... Oh, my gosh. Like, sheet or whatever, <laughs> and it was sticking in your bed, it would look like... Like a real butt. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> See, I'm thinking you. I'm thinking business. I'm thinking moving units. Oh, I, I definitely I'm thinking, am thinking, thinking like, that, We're too. trying to get, like the snuggy level well listen if you're going for the snuggy level what you need to do is forget the legs you just go with the butt that's what i'm saying and you just do two big old tushy butt cheeks <laughs> that are not that are not meant for comfort it's meant to be funny funny but it's also a pillow but then you also advertise it as it's the most comfortable pillow you'll Absolutely. ever put your head on Absolutely. squeeze it between two cheeks and then it's like really dirk -a -dirk -a -dirk. goofy yeah really goofy <laughs> and then people will be buying them as joke gifts you want to get that yes. joke market like yeah you know you're buying it for your brother at christmas because it's a good joke like right. you're buying it for grandma to get like that tiktok <laughs> viral reaction right like, right that's what i'm going after not this weird lonely sad man market why did they andrew are yeah. you weird lonely and sad is that why they showed this <laughs> well, i'm getting <laughs> older 
the <laughs> <laughs> happy birthday. They probably I don't, heard I don't you. Know. Your phone heard you one day be like, I'm sad. And your phone was <laughs> like <laughs> And your phone was like, We have the product for you. Mm, mail. 36 i'm right in their demographic <laughs> you know what i think 36 is the start of like and then goes oh, no. 36 to like 56 uh, like what are his other interests hmm <laughs> mma dungeons and dragons yeah this is a sad yeah, lonely a dude. sad man sad lonely dude <laughs> send him the buttress send him the butt pillow i hate the word buttress i it's really a dumb hate name. it it's, i think they tried to do butt mattress but it's not a mattress it's a pillow but i guess what would be billow the b- no, Batillo? No, terrible. Bat- just call it something else. Okay, what, you, what would you name it? Why don't you just give these pillows some dignity? <laughs> I mean, come on. Okay, come up with the name. I don't know. Um, just something like, better. Like, this is the overall company name. We can do this. Um, the Cotton buns. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> I think we can do better, though. Okay. Um. That's I, mine. I like it. That's that's so far that's but in the it running. is but it 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 plays into the fetish a little bit too much because mm. it's kind of like very like you know I feel like, sweet. Yeah, but I feel like the word booty might be. Oh, booty's a great booty word. Booty should be in there. I'm, I'm yeah, spitball on that. Yeah. Um, booty pillows too on the nose. Yeah, but not bad. Not bad, but I, that's yeah. probably already like a thing. The booty comfort. Uh, close. Yeah. Close. Just call it the booty. The booty. That's good. The I like bo- it. The booty. The booty. Because <laughs> it's. I'm thinking the snuggie. Yeah. I'm trying to stick to that market. You're really on that snuggie. Because uh, everybody bought one. I know. I'm jealous. I was. I had one because it was given to me as a gift. That's what I'm. And saying. it was. It was like. I mean, it was thin, but you put it on, and you were like, well. I'm going to wear this now. Yeah. It's a free blanket. It literally, yeah. it's just a blanket with armholes. Yeah. Yeah. Probably one sure. of the most ingenious things of ever. Course. I'm so mad that like I didn't think of it. That's wow. basically, that's how I feel about everything. Is that why now that you're sad? Well. Yeah. That's why I got offered the buttress. <laughs> Freaking buttress. It was such a terrible name. It just sounds so like hard. Yes. The buttress. Buttress. Welcome to the buttress. And, when you, and a buttress is like a, you know, that's reinforcing something. It's not soft. Right. Ugh. I don't like that movement you were doing. I just, <laughs> I don't know. That's reinforcing yeah, something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, all right. We're, we got to move on from the booty talk. Anyway, sorry. I got real excited about the advertisement because it made me laugh real hard. Yeah. And I knew you would appreciate it, okay? I definitely have I, gotten... I had half a thought to buy you one and surprise you with it just for the comedy but then i looked at the prices oh here I, we go this is what i forgot to bring can up. i guess that's what I, I wanted you to guess so let's start with um the uh the original the tiny one the smallest booty that they offer mm. which is still pretty big it's four pounds whoa the smallest one they offer is four pounds okay how well much then i'm gonna you, guess how much do you think it costs i'm, I'm gonna guess 65 dollars not bad. Not yeah. a bad guess. Normally, on th- everything's on sale right now. Oh, of course. Which is like, obvi- All the time. Of course, yeah. Right. Originally, $149, it's a bargain. I mean, you're getting two cheeks for the price <laughs> of one right now. You're getting <laughs> it's only $69 right now. Nice. Nice. Of course, <laughs> it had to be 69 So you can get the, the little one, the little booty, for $69 right sure. now. Sure. Um, how about the next th- size up, the OMG or the? I'm gonna guess it's gonna jump twenty more dollars. So if it's sixty nine, I'm gonna for say for a whole more pound, it's another pound of oh, pillow one more booty. Pound? Yeah, okay. so this is five pounds of pillow booty. You'd be paying a hundred and twenty nine dollars. What? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yep. And then if you want the big mama, the uh, the Becky, the big old Becky, the Becky, the big Becky. This is six pounds of pillow. That's a that's a heavy pillow. That's crazy. That's a really you could hurt someone with that. Yeah. Uh, how much you paying for that big one? I'm guessing like what was the last one? Last one was one twenty nine. Oh shoot! I'm gonna say like one eighty nine. No, 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 no. That's too much. Nobody's paying that for the the big booty. This is gonna be one thirty nine. Okay, not bad. Not bad. I'll take it. <laughs> Sold. <laughs> Sold. <laughs> all right, all right. The buttress. We got a customer. We did it. 
hey, if you guys want to sponsor the show, we've just talked about you guys for like 40 minutes. Yeah. Come on. Come on now. We need some sponsors over <laughs> here. <laughs> we'll be part of your marketing team. I'll do it. I'll, I, yeah. I mean, if someone sent me a booty pillow, <laughs> I'm going to lay on it. I'll do the podcast with one behind sure. my neck. I'll just. I'll just tuck the the thighs around my neck and just do the whole podcast yeah, like that. Yeah, that sounds just, great. We, can both, we both can do it. Love so, it. So yeah, the prices are a little steep for a joke yes. pillow. It's that's because it's not a joke I know. pillow. They're going the weird way. They're going the wrong route. I just feel that's what you think. I what do you think? I don't know. I, I don't know. know. I don't know. I don't. Anyway, enough of that. I have seen. There's a lot of like memes out there of like the wish version of stuff like the <laughs> yeah. the site if you don't know wish also sells like it's like amazon but like way worse oh, the worst and i have gotten now that we've talked about i'm probably going to get advertisements but like i have gotten like ads would pop up and i would stare at the picture and not know what they were showing <laughs> me like it would look like i remember the one time it I'm not trying to be gross it just it looked like butt plugs. Ew. And I'm just like, <laughs> why am I getting this? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And yeah, then I, I like clicked on it and it's like something for like your hair or something. I was like, uh -huh. this is crazy. Uh-huh. 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 I know. You're judging me getting the buttress. I, You're over there getting butt plug what advertisements. What is wrong with us? I don't know. Now, you know what's hilarious is anybody who listens to this podcast is probably going to get recommended the buttress pillow now. Ooh. If you're listening to it and your phone is like hearing this, you're gonna you're probably gonna get the ad. Let us know if you do. <laughs> please, please comment. If you're on YouTube right now, take a second, comment, and let us know. Would you buy one? Would you use it? Would do you like you, one for Christmas? Do you have one? Oh, if you have one, definitely let us know. Are you a sad man? <laughs> or a sad lady? Maybe a sad lady. <laughs> or maybe that's just your thing. Maybe like you just, just have a thing. It. Like you just that's like your dream pillow. You just want to sleep on a big butt. <laughs> what if that truly solved all your like sleeping and neck problems? Oh my god! If for me, like personally, yeah. if it like because I do have a lot of neck issues. Yeah, I've, I've tried many pillows. And what if you got it mm -hmm. and you're like, I'm just gonna try it, and you slept on it, and the next morning you were like, Listen, <laughs> that was the best <laughs> night sleep of my life. I'd be a believer. You'd see me on their website as a testimonial and be like. I didn't know going into it how much I like it, but once I got that hundred and forty dollar yeah. butt pillow, man, my life changed for the better. Be you, me, and Nikki every night in bed. <laughs> hey, I'd be like, sorry, Amy, we got to make room for this <laughs> six pound <laughs> booty pillow. So weird. <laughs> so weird. It's the only way my neck will function. I don't want to be sad. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if that's ah. Uh, what if I mean it'd be weirder if it was like you that was like demanding like I need the butt pillow I need this in my <laughs> life <laughs> like whatever whatever floats your boat as long as you can just go to sleep <laughs> <laughs> shut up and go to sleep <laughs> wow that's not what I meant <laughs> that's what it sounded like <laughs> um all right well Amy unless you got something else no I was just gonna say thank you so much for following us oh thank you guys if you'd like you can follow us on Instagram journey .corndog. If you are listening anywhere, give us a rating on Spotify Please, or anything. Yes. And if you are watching on YouTube, hit subscribe. Share it with your friends. Share it with your friends or leave a comment. Anything like that helps us. Just it go, totally helps us. Go throw it on your Facebook page that you haven't been on in three years. <laughs> let your meemaw and Uncle Fred see it and, you know, let, let them, them know you're alive and watching weird yeah. stuff. Let them enjoy the, uh, the journey that you've been on. <laughs> Well, thank you, everybody, and thank we you. will see you next Tuesday. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.